Up, I'm a sucker for this country. I'm a sucker for the Star Spangled Banner, and I'm a sucker for this country. I like what we got here. I like it. A guy can say what he wants and do what he wants without having a bandit shoved through his belly. And that's all right, isn't it? You betcha. Yeah. Liberty is too precious a thing to be buried in books, Miss Saunders. Men should hold it up in front of them every single day of their lives and say, I'm free to think and to speak. My ancestors couldn't. I can. And my children will. In our struggle for freedom, we've hit the canvas many a time, but we always bounce back because we're the people and we're tough. Well, we don't want anybody coming around changing that, do we? No, sir. No, sir. And when I do, I get mad. I get boiling mad. And right now, John, I'm sizzling. I know a lot of you who are, are saying, what can I do? I'm just a little punk. I don't count. Well, you're dead wrong. The little punks have always counted because in the long run, the character of a country is the sum total of the character of its little punks. Either I'm dead right or I'm crazy. You wouldn't care to put that to a vote, would you, Senator? <laughs> I get mad for a lot of other guys besides myself. I get mad for a guy named Washington and a guy named Jefferson, and Lincoln. It's just the blood and bone and sinew of this democracy that some great men handed down to the human race, that's all. Lighthouses, John. Lighthouses in a foggy world. You know what I mean? Yeah, you bet. Mm. You better start right now. Don't wait till the game is called on account of darkness. Wake up, John Doe. You're the hope of the world. John, you're a wonderful...